What's up, guys? I'm Kwan. I am living in Kuala Lumpur, and I'm a Malaysian. I am now at the Kepong Botanical Garden. Last week, they just opened a new feature. It is a tower and a bridge, 50 meters above the ground. My turn, which is about 10:45, and now it's only 10 o'clock. So I'm gonna take a walk of these beautiful places. I'll see you later. Before I go up to the bridge and the tower, I take a slow walk along the walking path. It is a good place for family get together. There's a scenic scenery here, and it is a joggers heaven. There's plenty of picnic spots, and it is amazingly tranquil. So whether you want to have a fitness run or a leisurely walk, this is one of the nicest gardens that I have visited. There's a so-called secret forest in the garden. Actually, it is a man-made forest trail. This place is called Danai Rasa. Danai means trails in Malay. It is fully covered with some very old and tall trees. You can literally walk there not being afraid of sunlight. It's forever cooling and pleasant here. Along the walking trail is the Kopong Botanical Garden Lake. It is a popular picnic spot. After that, I head back to the Skywalk entrance. Before you purchase the ticket, you need to fill in the form. That's to ensure that you are physically fit to go up to the bridge. You also need to provide an emergency contact. I think that is more for safety and precautionary measure. The skywalk is right inside the forest. There's a short trail about 100 meters leading you into the jungle. And that's a good thing because you won't be able to see it from outside. Before we climb up to the bridge, Let's listen to the instruction given by the person in charge. Selamat datang ke Forest Skywalk. Okay, untuk pengetahuan dia mula dibina tahun 2018, Disember. So, dia siap Disember 2019. So, dalam setahun lah. So, sebab kita ada PKP, so kita dapat buka awal. So, kita baru buka 31 hari bulan hari tu. So, baru lah. Okay. Itu uh, so baru beberapa hari lah, nampak hari macam tu. Okay, uh, panjang kecubungan dia 250 meter. So, kalau dari bawah sampai habis, dia jadi 500 meter lah. Okay. So, dia ada 11 tower dan juga 8 titian. Tower yang dia nampak tinggi-tinggi ni lah. Ha, ni ada tower lah, 11 tower. Yang mana naik 50 meter, dia boleh nampak yang sebelah sana tu. Yang tinggi sampai atas tu, tu yang 50 meter lah. Ha, dia akan naik ke atas tu. Siapa yang ada tiket, dia kena tunggu stand lah kat sana. Ha, eh? Dia ada akan ada pegawai dekat sana akan turun naik. Dia cuma boleh naik atas tu dua orang, dua orang. Dua orang naik, turun. Then dua orang akan naik. Ha. It's a stainless steel hanging bridge. It's a little bit shaky but it's still good enough to take beautiful pictures. This is the other side of the bridge, leading to the 50 meters tower. There's only two persons are allowed to go up to the highest point each time. It's my turn to go up. Beautiful view on the top, looking down to the forest beneath. If you look straight, that is a suburb called Kapong.
and the other side is the jungle. The steps are squeaky when I come down, and the next person will take my place. <laughs> How about if they make a glass bridge instead? I finally come down from the bridge, and my advice is to wear a hat if it is sunny, and check the weather before you come and make sure it's not raining, because up there is outdoor all the way. And thanks for joining me in this video. I highly recommend you to take your time when you are in KL to visit this new attraction. I'll make more traveling video whenever I visit some other places. And I hope I'll see you again in those videos. Peace.